Truckers XTV on air. We are now live in three, two, one. Welcome back to the episode of I So Man Files. In the previous episode, we continue our investigation. Today, except for right now, we're gonna go to Talent Agency Lemons Gate. If you have today's episode, make sure that like button is supported to the channel. If the front desk's lady is there, we're gonna try something out. If they brought it back. Let's see what happens. Oh, good timing. But why are these two here? I just happen to be here by chance. Me too. I'm here completely by coincidence. Okay then. So, what is it you wanted to tell me about the case? Yeah, about that. Who, who the hell is that? Hmm? What? Talk about sketchy. Maybe someone from the talent agency? I don't know. I couldn't see their face, so it's hard to say. Seems dangerous. But I'll put my life on the line to protect Tess. I, I, I mean, Iris. So, uh, don't you worry. M me too. Wow, what a total hottie. What? Oh, this is perfect. I was just starting to get bored. Come on, let's have a chat, cutie. A little tete-a-tete. -tete. Sorry, I have no idea what you're saying. Oh, and your voice is super mega hot, too. Hottie for a thotty. Slide into my DMs anytime, King. Um, I'm here to ask some questions for an investigation. Wait. You're with the police? Are you friends with Date by any chance? Yeah, he he's my superior. Oh my god, it's such a small world, crazy. Why is this woman a receptionist? Likely a decision made by the company president. Mizuki? It's okay, you don't have to say it. You wanna rub these soft things, don't you? No, I wasn't... Oh, fine. Just for a bit, okay? Here you go. Ryuki, what are you doing? Talking about Ryuki? No, I was just suddenly overcome with an inexplicable urge to go to a Tommy. Forget the investigation. I'm going to a Tommy with her. I've already made up my mind. Don't try to stop me. Did you take crazy pills this morning or something? Wait a minute. Are you serious? Do I look like I'm joking? Before we do anything else. Before we do anything else. Ryuki, please. I have a bad feeling about this. Now, let's go to Atami together! Uh, okay. Can't believe they brought this back. Early in the game, too. Early in the game. Of course. <laughs> oh my god, why are we back here? We got one route, that's for sure. Now back over here. 
Uh, oh my god. This time we can actually pick a spot, nice. Where's the other, where's the ending? Where's the ending? We're probably gonna go all the way down later on once we get there. Oh my god. Alright, back over here. Let's go. I was well prepared. schedule happened to be in my PC. I figured it was a cyber attack by a rival gang, so I came here to scout things out just in case. That's a huge stretch. He was probably just waiting for her. Thanks for everything, Mr. Kumakura. <laughs> Shopping! Cart, Mart, Tessa! Gaming! Bike, Sprite, Tessa! Account! Check, collect, Tessa! It's the brand new star of the net world, Tessa! Also known as ASET! You bet! I told you I just happened to be here. I just so happened to know Tessa's recording schedule. And I thought she might be thirsty after recording, so I got her a drink. In other words, he was waiting for her. Thanks for everything, Ota. <laughs> the QR code video. What? I read about it online this morning. Many people have gone missing since seeing that video. Rumors say that the missing people are being rounded up in one location, and they're all getting murdered. You there. Is what you just said true? Huh? Y yeah Who the hell are you? Don't get one step closer. That's right. What are you trying to do to Tessa? Sorry to bother you. And they're gone. What was that all about? Um, about our discussion. Oh, right. Did someone you know go missing or something? No, it's not that. It's just a rumor I found online. Tama, how many people have gone missing lately? About 1,700 people have gone missing this week. It isn't particularly higher than usual. Hmm. There's something paranormal going on in the HB case after all. Like half a corpse teleporting from another world. And people going missing after watching a video. There has to be some sort of supernatural phenomenon happening. with Tessa. The occult are involved with the HB case for sure. Right? Yeah. I mean, Nice is a part of all of this, right? Where did you hear that? It's all over the internet. Nice is a big proponent of the simulation theory. Oh, and I didn't know this a few months ago. I learned all this recently. If you think about that theory being correct, the case makes a lot more sense. After all, we are living in nothing but a simulation. And such programs always have some glitches lurking under the surface. Coincidences like this are a manifestation of such glitches. Proof of imperfection. Proof of the scenes. Uh, um, it's nice. 
to meet you. I've never been in such a big manner before. I'm feeling a bit nervous. Y yes, I'm good. Oh, you watched my stream? Thank you. I'm no expert on paranormal and occult stuff, but I know one thing for sure, so I gotta warn you. You should back out of this investigation. What do you mean? I don't know much about that nice group, but there's definitely a real dangerous organization involved in all this. If you get too deep, you might end up dead. Word's spreading in the underground. If the cops investigate any further, they'll make them disappear. Seems like the rich and powerful from all over the world are involved in this, too. You piss them off. Who knows what they'll do to you? Rich and powerful? Could Mr. Sajima be involved in this, too? Sajima? You mean the former politician guy? Yes, so Sajima. Oh, but don't worry about it. I just saw him recently, so he popped in my head is all. Wait, you met with So? Yeah. Why? Because he invited me to his house. For what reason? He said he happened upon my videos online and thought they were interesting or something like that. Uh, are you okay? He didn't do anything, did he? Not at all. We just talked for a bit. Whoa, there's a weird bug here. You're right. I've never seen it before. The simulation theory is probably true. There's even proof. Proof? Take a look at this. Doesn't this remind you of something? Like those nameless mob characters that show up in video games. You know they reuse assets to lower production costs. No. This is probably just some sort of coincidence. Like some synchronicity type thing? But there's more photographic proof. In a nutshell, they're basically meaningful coincidences. For example, when you talk about someone and they just so happen to show up in front of you. Or when you hear the same word over and over from a bunch of different people. That kind of synchronicity. It's supposed to mean that there's a message behind it. A message from who? Well... Someone. Do you still think it's a coincidence after seeing this? If you consider this stuff that can't be explained by science as a glitch in the simulated world... It can't be. Calm down, Ryuki. These are obviously doctored photos. Yeah, you're right. I just thought of something listening to Ota. You can explain any paranormal phenomenon using the simulation theory. UFOs, Umas, ghosts, superpowers? If this world is a simulation, they'd all be possible. Yeah, whether it's a glitch or alterations made on purpose, whatever it is, would all make sense. Now, let's get going. For all that talking we did, we didn't get much useful information here. Yeah, but something has been bothering me. I'll keep what I heard here in mind, just in case. There are some things that I've been thinking about, though. The biggest one being... The goal was to get inside the hidden room inside Horadori Institute. But in the end, we didn't find anything. A hidden room inside Horadori Institute? We have to look into this. After hearing about something like that... Well, I suppose so. So... 
All right, our next destination is? Yeah, Horadori Institute. No one here. It's past business hours, so they probably all left. But the lights are on. Maybe someone forgot to turn them off? The entrance wasn't locked, too. I think someone forgot to lock it. There weren't any guards around. Must be on vacation! No, oh, fine. I'm sorry, okay? Yes, you're right. Something is clearly wrong. It's as if someone is inviting us inside. A trap, maybe? For who? And why? No one could have known we were coming here. Then maybe it's for welcoming someone other than us. Who's there? Ryuki, living organism detected. They're alone. They must be hiding somewhere. Yo, can we just turn on the x-ray vision just to see where the heck the guy's at? I would rather turn on... Oh god, I'd be surprised if the person was right behind me. Not like I can see anything through those tube glasses. Oh, now it shows. There what? you are. Hey, I know you're there. Come on out! Kameji? What is he doing here? I don't even know myself. Before I knew it, I found myself here. Maybe my brain is messed up from all the drinking. Y yes. I think he's at home right now. He's clearly lying. He's obviously hiding the real reason he's here. Now, how to make him talk? He may be hiding something on his person. Let's find out. Is that... Why does he have that? Kameji, what are you hiding in your pocket there? I... I don't know what you're talking about. It's no use trying to hide it. What you have there, it's a pistol, isn't it? Kameji, can you please tell me what's going on? Game for action again. Let's go. You can't get away from us. He looks more faster than his appearance. Oh, come on! A mouse. He's just throwing anything inside in a complete circle. Oh, never mind. So much for action. But he's completely hysterical. We won't be able to talk to him like this, and we can't wait him either. We're only left with one choice. Ryuki, sync with him. <laughs> 